What's up everybody, it's Kyoto, and we're back with Popo LaCroix. In the last episode, a lot of stuff happened. We got to the fairy castle, we sunk that thing to the ground, everybody in there is just drowning now. Oh, it's chaos, but it's stupendous. Yeah, that happened all in the last episode. If you're watching this without having watched the previous one, what are you doing here? It's way too far into the series for you to be watching this. But in any case, you know, we found out a little bit more about Narcia. And, um, I guess we're on our way to Popola Christ right now, so that's where we'll be heading over. I'm gonna pop our garden, because I don't want to fight trash mobs right now. Just wonderful, enjoying the old music of Talking and Villages Forest. Whoa! Oh yeah, she just speaks to animals. That's that's normal, right? You, what's wrong? What are you doing here? Oh, these are some of my friends from the forest. Did we see them in the forest earlier? Maybe. The bow? Oh, it looks like he's made it. I'll go get it. Leona? Sorry, Pietro. He finished the bow. I need to go get it. I apologize for leaving but I need to pick it up. Oh. Don't worry, I promise I'll be back. Okay, come back soon. White Knight, look after him. I will. You know White Knight can always take care of us. White Knight is the man, he's the G. And I don't even know if we're gonna, you know, meet up with Leona again, to be honest with you, and oh my god! Is that a horse? I didn't know horses existed! And we're Prince. Where's our equestrian? Where's where's our our horse? That'd make things a lot easier. Are you are you freezing, horse? Hmm, that is quite odd. What was a horse doing out here freezing to death? You bastards! How could you do such a thing to a horse? Peter's gonna be all over you if that exists in this medieval world. Well, you know what? If they complained that much, they'd probably have been. Slaughtered by the state. Eh, well that sucks for them. What the hell? Nice cone, dunce! <laughs> Terrible. Um, hum. Oh, that's, oh, this person gets a voice? Oh no. You're Prince Pietro? Yes, I am Pietro. Excuse me, and you are? Hmm. <laughs> Don't be rude. I am... Mother dear. <laughs> um... Yeah! What? Exactly my thoughts to you, everybody. Juva, now mind your manners. Yes, mother dear. She's all acting polite and everything now that her mother's here. I am Roomba, the queen of Roma. My apologies for not introducing myself earlier. Thank you very much for your kindness towards my daughter, Jilva. Oh, Queen Roomba! Your Highness should have witnessed your daughter's bravery in battle. She would make a fine warrior! Hush, Mr. White Knight. Don't say anything about that. <laughs> she called me Mr. What's the matter, Jilva? Why are you being so formal? I liked it better when you would just yell, Come on, White Knight! Jilva? Yes, Mother dear? <laughs> She's gonna kill me. I've come to take you home. These folks have done a lot for you, but now it's time to come back home. Uh, uh, um... Jova? Yes, mother dear. So, please excuse us, everyone. We are leaving now. Please come visit the castle anytime you are in Roma. Farewell. I'm sorry, Prince Pietro. I have to go now. Take care. <laughs> yeah, oh, good riddance. Not to see your face ever again. Mr. White Knight? Take care, sir. Yeah, that's kind of weird. <laughs> Throwing everybody off. We are going, Jilva. Yes, mother dear. Oh, jeez. She seems like the one that actually commands the castle. I don't know about you guys. So... What did I do wrong? Everything. You're not supposed to blow her cover, you know what I'm saying? I hope we don't lose you, White Knight. 
because I don't want to lose you again. That is terrible without you in life. Hello, father. Hello, mother. I need to talk to you. Pietro, you've returned. Hmm. There is only one stone tablet left in the land of the dragons. I must go see the great dragon. We need to join forces. Right now? The situation is urgent. We can't allow Myra to steal the last tablet. Pietro, there are many strong dragons in the land of the dragons. My father, the great dragon, would never let Myra take the stone tablet. But, had you just got back from your journey, you must be exhausted. You'll need to be fully rested. Well, yes. Rest today and make your preparations for your trip. You can leave tomorrow. Queen Sonya's right. We should get some rest. We'll need it. Yes, I suppose so. Well, if that's the case, I guess we're going to bed. Dear father, I'll stay then. Good night, Pietro. Good night. I have to make his voice more old. <laughs> it's kind of like, it's not King Lee. It's not old King Lee, like, anymore. I forgot how I did that, but, you know, I'll pick it back up again. Thank you, dear father and dear mother. Sweet dreams. Uh, uh, we're having a nightmare? What's going on? Oh, oh, it's definitely a nightmare then. This is... Vaskal? Myra used to be the goddess of beauty, but her vanity changed her into this ugly creature. Pietro, do you understand the difference? Uh, um, why do you keep fighting? What's driving you? You are... Vaskal? What is this? No! Pietro, wake up! Huh? Something going on in the real world? Oh, Jesus. Uh, um, still sleeping. Come on, wake up, dude. Whoa! Holy crap! You have an extension arm? Is that is that a rubber fruit that you eat? Hmm. You evaded my attack. I am impressed. You're... Why are you so surprised? What are you looking for me? What are you going to do with Barbaran? What is going on here? What are you doing, Pietro? Why are you up so late? Ah! D dad How dare you? You can't do that. Hmm. What are you going to do now? You think you can challenge me? Enough! You are only human. Ah! Uh-oh, Pietro. You are nothing, and I, I am the goddess of beauty, more beautiful than any other. But the goddess of beauty has been reduced to this heinous form. I can't stand the indignity. You can't use Barbaron for your, your twisted schemes. I can overpower Jurius with the power of Barbaron. And I will become even more beautiful than ever before. I will have my revenge against Jurius for humiliating me. But he is your father. Some father. I have disowned him. He's nothing to me now. Have you lost your mind? Your heart has become as ugly as your appearance. You stupid human. What do you know? Ah! <laughs> now you will die. You'll regret challenging me. <clears throat> Paolo. Pietro. I know the story of the dragon princess who fell in love with a human king. Her father disowned her. Really? Is that what happened? 
。まだよ。<笑> How I've waited for this moment, Sanya, the daughter of the great dragon. <coughs> Pietro, don't move. I'll kill him if you even twitch. Ah. <laughs> Good. Now, let me have your body if you want him to stay alive. What? <laughs> I just want your body. If I said I want your body now. Anything wrong with that? No. Mother. Ah.、Uh, <coughs> Pietro. What now? I'm losing my patience. Pietro. Don't do it. Don't do it. You know, if he dies, you can just make another one. You already had a daughter on the way. You can have another son. Go ahead. Do what you will. <laughs> Isn't motherly love sweet? Stupid. You will all die because of your worthless devotion. Ah! P Pietro. I will have your body. Ah!、Uh... No, and you're gonna use the body to take over and trick the Dragon King or whatever his name is.、Mm, this is going all too smoothly for you. But we already know what the plan is, or we should at least. Mother! Uh, mother! <laughs> mother? Oh no! Dad? Dad! I have to go save my wife! Sonya, I will go! <coughs> He's old, so he has to have an old cough, right? <laughs> dear father? Why do you call him dear father? That, that seems like a little much. Your Majesty, you cannot go! Oh my god, look who it is! Pietro! I'm sorry I caused you trouble before. And now Queen Sonya is. If only I hadn't let Myra catch me off guard. But why Queen Sonya? Myra has stolen her body. Yes, Myra is using Queen Sonya's body just like they used yours. She is headed for the land of the dragons. Let's go, Pietro. Pietro, you're the only one who can save Sonya. Go and stop Myra. The fate of our world rests on your shoulders, Pietro. <coughs> father, Pietro, go save Sonya. Yes, father, I will. Let's go. And you know what? We're about to start our vicarious journey on the way to save our mother. Once again, mind you. So, I think this is a good place to end. We'll go on with the rest of the story from here on out. This has been Kyoto. Leave all your comments in the comment section below. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Later!